In this video, we going to review the top 5 best DSL modem for CenturyLink that are available on the market. We made the list based on their popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinion, and more. To see the most up-to-date prices, check out the links in the description below. Number 1. CenturyLink C3000A the CenturyLink C3000A is the modem I recommend as an all-around option. Because it's compatible with every single CenturyLink internet type. That said, if you have the 940 megabits per second fiber optic internet plan, you should know that this modem slash router will not deliver you that speed. This is because it is a Wi-Fi 5 router with a single 5 GHz band. And from my testing, no Wi-Fi 5 router ever reached more than 600 megabits per second in Wi-Fi speed. Nevertheless, if you have a 500 megabits per second plan or less, this modem slash router is likely your safest bet. Because no matter what center link internet you have, it will work. Number 2. Zixel PK5001Z. If you have a really slow internet connection and don't plan to upgrade it, consider the Zixel PK5001Z. It's a modem slash router that's only compatible with ADSL internet. Meaning if you have a faster DLS internet plan than 20 megabits per second, you can't use it. And honesty, it's for the better. Because the router is equipped with Wi-Fi 4, an old wireless standard, which most likely couldn't give you much more than 20 megabits per second anyways. This means that this modem slash router will probably be best if you live in more rural areas. With little access to anything faster than what you currently have. Number 3. ZYXEL C3000Z. The Zixel C3000Z is very much like the C3000A, and if either is out of stock, you can confidently get the other. But like the C3000A, I don't recommend using it with a fiber plan exceeding 500 megabits per second. Because the wireless standard on the router is Wi-Fi 5, which from my experience only reaches about 500 megabits per second. Nonetheless, if you have an internet plan at 500 megabits per second or below, the C3000Z is a great option. The modem slash router also makes a good choice if you plan to bridge it, turning off the router because it's very easy to do with the C3000Z. Bridge mode is necessary to use a separate modem and router. You might want this for better performance with faster internet plans and extra features. Number 4. Greenwave C4000XG. The Greenwave C4000XG is for you with a fiber optic connection, anything else and the device won't work for you. This includes all the ADSL and VDSL standards, both bonded and non-bonded. I repeat, do not get this modem with any of them, only fiber. The router is Wi-Fi 6, so you can use this router for any internet plan. Even the gigabit plan. That said, the best part about the device is that it's pre-configured for CenturyLink's internet. Meaning you can just plug it in, and you are ready to go. But know that if you are prepared to do some simple setup, you can use a better router for a lower price. Number 5. Action Tech C1900A. Do you love the flexibility of the Action Tech 3000A but not the big price tag? No worries. This model works with most of CenturyLink's DSL technologies too which will give you a lot of flexibility if you move around but want to stick with CenturyLink Internet. And like the ActionTech and Zixel models above, the ActionTech C1900A supports fast Wi-Fi speeds. It runs a little slower on ADSL than the ActionTech 3000A, but it's unlikely you'll run into a plan where that matters. So if you want to save a bit, check out this scaled-down and cheaper ActionTech model. If you like it, ask your CenturyLink rep if you can get it through them and save a few more bucks, this is one of the wireless modems CenturyLink offers.